Ok, guys, we're here today with Mika Galvão, huge honor for me. Guys, Mika, if you guys are following the Jiu-Jitsu scene, he's the new guy. He's like probably like the most dangerous uh, fighter right now. He, he, he competes with Gi, no Gi, he's tapping everybody, he's winning a ton of tournaments, and he's 17 years old. So for this video here about how to get better in Jiu-Jitsu and learn faster, Mika, what's your suggestion for the... For whoever I know that you study a lot of online jiu-jitsu, right? you just told me that you watched like three courses right before. Yep. What, what do you do? Like, how did you become who you are? And uh, well, you what's know, your tip for everybody? You know, like, I think like for me, actually, for myself, my dad always tell me that uh, I'm a very intelligent person. Like, if I see a position, like I can start seeing it a little bit. I see the details, just like I said, oh, Mika, you gotta study a little more, like. I'm, I, I, as I said, I studio Jiu-Jitsu, but the, the moment that I see something new, I can start applying it right away. So that's something that helps me a lot. That's why I, I keep looking for more and more and more Jiu-Jitsu. And right before I did my, my courses here, my instructionals, I was looking like for many like arm attacks on other people courses. Like, okay, oh, this guy do that, does this difference. Oh, okay, 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 he does this, he does this. And then on the middle of it, I was like, oh, I'm getting something new. Oh, I like it. And then I started applying on my training. So I was like, I think uh, my tips for everyone is have your mind open it because you can get like knowledge from people that you don't even think. Like I get uh, knowledge from purple belts, blue belts, uh, even sometimes white belts that are for like water sports. They give me tips from uh, stuff that I haven't even imaginated. And... I think the biggest tip I can give to someone is try to learn something and apply it right away because acknowledge that you don't apply it is something that's just going to be stored there and there's be, uh, there's going to be no meaning for it, you know, if you don't use it. Yeah. So you try to consume as much content as possible and then yeah. when you see something that matches with your style, you try to apply right away. Yeah, to save it, of course. And also, if you can, like... My dad always tell me to do something, like always keep reviewing it and then repeating and see it, review and repeat it again. That's something that we, we do on our training, on our gym. We have been doing it for many, many years. So I think that's the way uh, I've been growing. Like, so the, the people think it's like something fast. I know uh, everybody wants to grow very fast on the yeah, Jiu-Jitsu, yeah, but yeah. that's something. Yeah, we, no, we were just talking about that. Like you were the <laughs> overnight success that took 10 years. Yeah. Or that, 12 <laughs> years, right? <laughs> that's and the overnight success that was like three, yeah. four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten 10 years. But it's something like you gotta be always aware is that you're gonna get something new, you're gonna review it, you're gonna practice, and then you're gonna get good at it. Yeah. So just get a knowledge, put it on practice, review it, practice again, and then you can go for something new. But always have your mind open it for uh, new knowledge from anyone. And guys, for those who doesn't know, like uh, he he's trained from his dad since he started, and his dad is becoming like one of the most legendary coaches in Brazil. So. He has this team of 21 athletes in, it's a social project in Manaus, and they're all becoming like a, like Mika Galvão. So there's a bunch of other Mika Galvões coming from there. And the, your dad just told me something today that I think I'm never going to forget, that his goal is always to make everyone in the team to focus and learn one technique per month. Yeah. Because then at the end of the year, they got really good at 12 techniques, the mm -hmm. end of three years, 36 te techniques, the end of five years, 60 techniques. So Yeah, that's something he, he always liked to play. My dad is a very, very, very intelligent guy that likes to play with math. So he's like, okay, guys, who can not learn a technique a month? And everybody's going to like, no, I think everyone can do it. Okay, now, if you have tw uh, 12 techniques a year, which is like one a month, in five years, you're going to have how much? Uh, how many techniques? Oh, we're going to have 60. Anyone here that practices jiu-jitsu uh, for five years has 60 strong positions on your game? Some people are like, mm, I don't think I have that much. And he was like, okay, imagine if you have been doing this yeah, since you started. Enough. And then yeah. I'm like, oh, yeah, we should have done that before. Yeah. No, you so, can almost match with everything you said, right? You, come, you, you, you try to learn as much as you can. Mm -hmm. But you also don't need to execute everything, right? You pick the yeah. one that you like the most and you apply right away, like, yeah. right? But it's something uh, uh, he does it to like he forces 
but uh, he does like uh, uh, his method of course he, he has like his instructional that he shows how he do it with us there like that's something that many people don't have it's a way of learning he tries to show us the technique but the, the thing is he doesn't show us only technique and solo technique because that's something you can uh, you can find on YouTube you can find on BG fanatics here but it's like the way they teach is something I, I, I see on some courses that I, I've been watching like uh, uh, I watched as I said four courses yeah, before I come yeah. here to do my instructional yeah, so guys, this, he's 70 years old, black belt, and he watched four courses just this week. So, uh, so the, the <laughs> there's no miracles here. Like, <laughs> yeah, we need to keep studying because Jitsu does something. Uh, Jitsu is something amazing. It never stops growing. Something like infinite. Uh, if you think, oh no, Jitsu now it's done. No, there's gonna be a, a guy coming with new knowledge just like yeah. right away. Oh, there's something new here. Oh, there's something new here, and then it keeps just growing, yeah, growing, yeah. growing. And that's why I think everybody needs to try and find knowledge all the time. Yeah. Yeah. That's, oh, man, that's really incredible. Uh, and uh, it's it's amazing to see like, how young you are, but how mature you are. You know? like, <laughs> I think in most of the 17 year old kids are not thinking like that. <laughs> they're, they're just thinking about like uh, how would be the party after the tournament that they won and blah, 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 blah. And you were really focusing the preparation. So that, that's yeah. that's really incredible. Yeah, thanks so much, yeah, Mika. Thank you so much, Hey, guys, uh, Mika has a bunch of courses at bggfanatics.com, so make sure to check that out. He is an amazing athlete and even better instructor. If you guys see him teaching, it's really, really impressive, like, how knowledgeable he is, how calm he is teaching, like, and the, it's it's really impressive. So make sure to check that out, and thanks so much, Mika. Yeah, thanks so much, Professor. Really appreciate it. Please help me out to grow my YouTube channel. Just click subscribe. And to watch more videos, just click under See More Videos. I hope you enjoyed. BJJFanatics.com. Use the promo code YouTubeFaria to get 10% off any instructional video. Improve your jujitsu faster.